We're Adam and Joanne from InspiredTaste.net, and welcome to our kitchen. Hi there, we're making our guilt-free zucchini pasta recipe. The first question you might want to ask is what exactly is a zucchini noodle or zucchini pasta? Which is an excellent question. So basically, instead of using regular boxed dry pasta, we actually make zucchini noodles out of fresh zucchini. Now in this recipe, we use what's called a spiralizer which is this thing. This wonderful device. It's not very expensive, so if you do want to get one, there you can buy them online. But if you don't have one or don't feel like buying one, we've given two or three more ways to make zucchini noodles on the recipe page on Inspired Taste. So be so, sure to check those out. Yeah, so you really you don't need this, but it does make it quicker. Let's get to it. We start by making the zucchini noodles. There are multiple ways to make them, but we are using our spiralizer because it's ridiculously fast. I know this looks like a lot of zucchini, but trust us, after some time in a hot pan, it wilts down quite a bit. Since the strands are so long, we like to cut them into shorter lengths. Just make them similar to spaghetti. To make the noodles taste great, we cook it with garlic, tomatoes, basil, and Parmesan cheese. Canned and fresh tomatoes will work. Since we have some, we're using fresh. Just roughly chop them up. We like using quite a bit of garlic. We are looking for about one tablespoon of minced garlic, which is about four cloves. For the cheese, we love Parmesan and like to grate it ourselves. It tastes better this way. Any salty cheese will work in its place though. Let's move to the stove. We start with a room temperature pan, then add olive oil, garlic, and red pepper flakes. As the oil heats up, it becomes infused with the garlic. When the oil is bubbling, add the zucchini. The noodles will need five minutes or so in the pan. We're looking for them to become wilted, but still have a bit of crunch. As they cook, toss them around the pan so all the noodles have a chance to hit the bottom of the skillet. When they are wilted, throw in the tomatoes, lots of fresh basil, and most of the cheese. Save some for sprinkling on top later. After about a minute, the noodles are done. Just transfer them to a serving bowl, but leave the liquid in the pan. Since the liquid is pretty thin, we like to thicken it with a little cornstarch mixed with water. We only use about a teaspoon, but it makes a huge difference in the texture of the sauce. When it's thick and shiny, pour it over the noodles and finish with more basil and the cheese you saved earlier. And that's it. Easy, quick, and light zucchini noodle pasta. Eat it as is or toss some cooked shrimp or chicken on top. Enjoy! Thanks for watching. If you love this video, we have lots more. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and say hi on Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. We're at Inspired Taste.